Satu 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 ko Satu 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 ko Sente Agenti Satu ko Sente Mobile Satu ko Sente Visa Satu 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 ko Satu Satu Do the Satu ko Satu and swipe Do the Satu ko Satu and smile Do the Satu ko Satu and win Win crazy money in Satu ko Satu Transact free or more times using Sente Mobile Sente Agent or Sente Visa And win 100k weekly Directly on to your account The more you transact The more you win Terms and conditions apply Centenary Bank Our bank Centenary Bank is regulated by the Bank of Uganda Customer deposits are protected by The Deposit Protection Fund Well, there you go Satu Kusatu is what we are here to discuss today You're welcome from wherever you're tuned in from You're tuned into the Satu Kusatu Live discussion from Mapera that is going to happen for the next uh, about an hour. And we're just going to be discussing all details and, uh, you know, excitement around the Satu Kusatu campaign. My name is Michael Bulirali, the manager digital communications for your bank. Again, I'm glad to be back here after I think a week or so. I know we're supposed to engage last week, but uh, because of uh, other planned activities, we're not able to be here. But well, this week, I also have uh, some exciting people who are going to be talking to you. Uh, as you saw earlier in our announcement, we have our chief manager, uh, branding and marketing, Immaculate, who is live. She will also be talking to us specifically about matters Satoko Satu campaign. And then I have the opportunity again to interact with uh, our diaspora banking supervisor, who is none other than Nancy, she will be here to, she's here to specifically address the questions that uh, will be coming in about diaspora banking. So I hope you're all keeping well. Uh, it's a good morning. It's a good evening. You know, it's a good afternoon because we know you're tuned in from all over the world. Now, I, sorry, we came in a little bit late. We're trying to fix uh, a few things behind the scenes. But as you know, it, uh, it's not in our culture really to start our live sessions late. So for that, we want to apologize. There's already a number of questions that came in. The moment we announced that we are going to be talking to you today about the Satoko Satu promotional campaign that uh, is on fire, just to borrow someone's words. So, you know, someone said, one time said, the country is on fire. Yes, the country is on fire, actually, because of the Sato Kusatu campaign. And we'll just be letting you know exactly why the country is on fire. Because people are excited. People are already winning. If you haven't yet won, it means you're not uh, transacting, you know, following what we've told you to do. So in a minute, we'll be sharing more details on how you can be able to participate in this campaign and uh, stand a chance to win. That is the 100,000 shillings that we're giving out on a weekly basis. So without uh, further ado, I'd like to first and foremost uh, introduce my the, the people that I'm hosting today. Starting with you, Machulet, say hello to our uh, uh, viewers and listeners, I'm told, before we start. Uh, thank you very much, Michael. Hello, everyone. We are excited to be with you, engaging with you this morning, this afternoon, this night, from wherever you are. Uh, thank you for listening in, watching us this morning. We are here to discuss a couple of things with you that we think will benefit uh, you and, of course, uh, everybody. Uh, first of all, I also want to thank you for being our customers. Those who are already uh, banking with the with Centenary Bank and those who wish and are happy to join us, we are here to serve you. So hello, everyone. Uh, thank you for joining in. Yes, there yeah, you had it from a much late. Always excited to talk to you, our customers. The moment we reached out to her to come and engage with us, she could not uh, let the opportunity pass. Then I also have another, I don't want to call her guest because our... Uh, our customers in the diaspora have certainly interacted with her, as well as Immaculate. But uh, this one is very special because she, you know, she she has that personal touch with some of you in the diaspora. Nancy, please uh, say hello to our viewers, and we shall continue from there. Nancy, unmute. Uh, thank you, Michael. Uh, good morning, our viewers, our listeners, and. Uh, I'm happy to be here. Uh, thank you all for viewing, for listening, and for banking with us. We are here to address all your questions. 
relating to your financial needs uh, with our bank. Thank you, Michael. Thank you so much. Yeah, and uh, so let's continue. I know we've uh, started it a little bit late, but much late. Um, I know we've been communicating this campaign for a couple of weeks now. In, in a matter of fact, some people have already won. But um, for, for someone who is tuning in today for the very first time or someone who is listening to us and watching us for the very first time, I, I would like you to give them a brief background of why this Satu Kusatu campaign and, and how the name, you know, Satu Kusatu was coined by, you know, the creative team. Imagine it. Uh, thank you very much, Michael. Our viewers, our listeners, uh, Satu Kusatu, what is Satu Kusatu? Saku, Satu Kusatu is a promotional campaign that we are running uh, as a way to give back to our customers first. Uh, firstly, we want to give back to our customers who have stood with us. We feel it's school fees time. There's so many needs and limited resources. So we are saying we have three alternative channels currently. We have one, the Sente Mobile, which is banking on your phone. Two, you've seen the Sente Agents. Centenary Bank has 5,400 Sente uh, Agents across the country. Uh, and we have the Sente Visa, uh, which is the, the, your, your, your visa card that you, you, you got from Centenary Bank. All we are saying is transact three times on these three channels. And I will repeat for emphasis, we have the Sente Visa card. We have the, the Sente Mobile, which is banking on your phone, on the go. And then we have the Sente Agent. And we are, all we are saying is transact three times a day, on a month, a week, sorry. Three times a week on, a, on any, of, any or all of these channels. You can transact one time on Sente Mobile, another time you transact on Sente Agent, maybe another time you transact on card or use Sente Mobile three times, depending on your consumer behavior. Because we have also uh, realized that on a day-to-day -day basis, you'll have to pay things like your car, top up for your car, umeme, national water. Uh, gone are the days where you needed to go to uh, Umeme office to pay for to top up your car, go to a bank to pay for these utilities. You're paying DSTV, you're paying for start times, and you need to trek, uh, for lack of a better word, to trek to the bank or to these service centers to pay for all these things. You can use your visa card, you can go at the pay at the center agent. In every town, every small locality, you will find that we have over on the app of 20, 000, 20 agents in a small town where you can yeah. pay for these services. So all we are saying, use these services three times a week. Uh, and I will em emphasize the week, three times a week and you stand a chance. The more times, you can even transact 20 times. The more times you transact, the more chances you stand to be a winner. And for every single week, we give out over uh, 80, uh, eight, eight, we give about over 80 customers, over 100,000 shillings for doing exactly that. So what better way than being rewarded for doing what you have to do anyway, paying your bills, paying school fees we are in the school fees season i'm sure all, not all every parent has kids are still at home for crying out loud you could pay in, in bits but paying at the agent paying using center mobile so long as you have a student number and you'll find that your child will go to school you'll find that your life will be made easy uh thank you michael i think that is sent satu kusatu which is the yes. campaign that we are running until the end of july Thank you. Absolutely. There you had it. Satu Kusatu, someone was wondering why now Satu Kusatu, the other time you had five for five. No, you know we are people's bank, so we we tend to listen to customers' feedback. A couple of customers reached out and they were telling us, you know, the five transactions that uh, we did last time, you know, during the festive season were a bit high, but me, I try. I can do about two to three transactions a week. So why don't you lower the number of transactions to to make it all inclusive and that is exactly what we did yeah so that's why you see it is now very very competitive as we shall be discussing a number of people have won so far 
but like I'm telling you, it's really, really competitive uh, that you have to really transact as many times as you can, even about three times for you to stand a chance to win. Now, Imagulet has just spoken to us about how you need to participate. It's very simple. Uh, make sure you perform any transaction on any of those channels that she has mentioned. That is Center Mobile, Center Visa or Center Agent at least three times in a week and you will stand a chance to enter the, you know, the, the draw where we pick our weekly winners and you're rewarded with 100,000 shillings. That Now that money is uh, sent to your account. We don't, uh, you know, give it out cash. We send it to your account such that you can be able to transact conveniently. What we're trying to uh, encourage here is to, for you to transact from wherever you are anytime such that, uh, you know, you don't go through the hassles that Imachulet was talking about, beating the traffic, you know, having to leave your job because some of you operate uh, one woman, one man's business, whereby if you close, it means uh, you're not going to make that money because you've come to the bank to do a transaction. So these channels are designed to, you know, to help you do it conveniently without the need to move an inch. Now, let us continue. There's a question that came in from uh, Stacy. And uh, she was asking that, uh, what if I pay my, my child's school fees using Center Mobile? Does that qualify? Uh, maybe I'll just, uh, after Immaculate has answered that, but I'm sure she did, I will just also shed some more light on how you can pay your school fees on Center Mobile uh, for you to be able to, you know, stand a chance to win that 100,000 shillings. Immaculate, just to, to answer Stacy. Yeah, uh, Stacy, good, good, good morning. I hope it's a morning or good afternoon, wherever you are. Oh, good evening. Uh, yes, Stacy. School fees is part of the, 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 the transactions that you will do in order to enter this draw. Uh, there is another a very interesting product, Michael, that I'd like to inform our viewers and, 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 and listeners this morning. And yeah. this is the Sente Voucher. The Sente sure. Voucher is a very interesting product that we, we have since launched. It's new on the market. And you can actually send, most of our parents are either up country, in the villages, basically uh, urban, uh, sorry, rural or uh, uh, semi-urban areas mm -hmm. and may or may not have phones. Uh, yes. yes, but I know that the phone penetration is high, but still we have parents out there, we have relatives who don't have phones. So gone are the days where you have to worry. No, my, you know, my auntie doesn't have a phone. My, my, how will I then send, uh, uh, uh how will I send them money? So the center uh -huh. voucher, I would naturally have an account with Centenary Bank, or you have an account with Centenary Bank. You are registered on Center Mobile. You initiate a voucher of yeah. say uh, 100,000. Now this voucher, you'll get, of course, the details of that voucher, pass them on to the first person you're sending this money to. This person only needs to present themselves at the center agent. And at mm -hmm. the center agent, this person will not be asked to pay any money in order to redeem. If you have sent 100,000, your parent will be able to get 100,000. You, the yeah. initiator of the voucher, is the one who pays for the transaction. So your parent, your grandparent, your auntie, your uncle, your relative in the village will get the full value of the voucher, even if they are not Centenary Bank customers. Exactly. And I want to in, in, emphasize the fact that they don't have to be Centenary Bank customers. They have to only go to a center agent and redeem this voucher. And we think that it is cheap. It is a fast way of, and all of us have people who are up country who probably do not have places where they are going to receive this money. And of course, if you do multiple transactions, you're pulling from your phone, putting it on your wallet, that's empty, the, the, the MNOs and the, the, the telecoms, the telecoms are the people who, who, who support you with the phone numbers, then it gets very expensive. But pull it from your bank send the voucher to the center agent it is cheap it is convenient it is easy so even when you do that you still enter the draw for satu kusatu absolutely yeah, yeah. thank you so, so I much hope I, ans I answered stacy but i think i also needed to shed light on this new exciting product that the bank has for the mm. for our for our customers absolutely and uh you know that goes to speaking to our tagline of our bank because we don't want to we are family so if you are a customer 
your family is, is also part of our our client base. So that's why we are, you know, churning out solutions such as the one that the voucher that you actually just explained there, so that you're able to send money, you know, and take care of your loved ones, even when they're not Centenary Bank customers. And as we go on, we shall also be touching on another, you know, service, another card service that enables you to, uh, you know, be able to give money and, uh, money for shopping, money for upkeep to your family without them necessarily having to open an account with Centenary Bank. There was a question that came in earlier as well around how to to redeem a, a prize if you're selected. I think I did pronounce myself on this one by saying that uh, the money is wired to your account. So there's no need to, to even worry that uh, we're going to call you. Uh, should you receive a phone call of someone telling you you've won in, in the Satoku Satu campaign and, uh, you know, they, they want to give you money or something like that, please call our toll free lines to confirm because we're not going to call you. We're certainly going to just wire your money on the account. But also where to double check, you should look, uh, check our social media accounts because we upload the lists of the winners on a weekly basis so you'll be able to see your name there if you indeed you received uh, an anonymous call from someone and they're telling you you've won uh, which should not happen so just please always double check on our social media pages but you can also call our toll free lines as well as uh, i'm sure solomon in the in the background will just uh, you know display our toll free lines there for you to see them as well as our info email you can drop us an email uh, such that we're able to interact with you to avoid, you know, being scammed by unscrupulous people. Yes. So as we move on, Immaculate, maybe let's speak a little more about uh, Sente Agent Banking in as far as the Satoku Satu campaign is concerned. But the little more I want us to focus on is specifically around what kind of transactions. We've already talked about the voucher. The kind okay. of transactions that uh, uh, a user should be able to perform at any location countrywide for them to be able to enter the, the draw to win the 100,000 shillings on a weekly basis. Okay, Michael, thank you very much for the question. Trans what should a customer do when they get to a center agent? What are those services that a customer should seek out so that then they enter the draw? You can pay school fees. I think I talked about that. You can pay for your utilities. By utilities, you have your national water, you have the umeme, you have the yaka, you can pay for star times, you can pay for DSTV, you can you can you you can uh, withdraw money at the agent point. If you withdraw money, uh, you can go to the agent and actually withdraw your money using uh, a card you can use your center visa card uh, by the way that's a very new one as well you can use your center visa card to actually withdraw money at the center agent so all these services you can will help you enter this draw and you will be able to win the hundred thousand school fees uh, the utilities uh Utilities meaning national water, umeme, yaka, then the pay TVs. Pay TVs yeah. include Star Times, it includes DSTV, and so much more. The exactly. bouquet of services that you can do at agent points, everything you can do in the bank, you will do at a center agent. And Michael, there's also another point that I wanted to raise, which is very new and very exciting. And this is on center mobile. I know that most of the viewers today, the listeners in, are digital natives. They're always on, on the phone. They're always on their laptops, iPads, doing mm. things. And they don't have the time, the leisure the, of time to, to, to walk into banks. You can actually send an EFT. An EFT is an electronic funds transfer. Imagine yes. I have to pay Michael. Michael is banked in Bank of Africa. And I am in Centenary Bank. I am registered on Centre Mobile, and I'm, of course, fast forward. I am a Centenary Bank customer. Then, secondly, I am I am registered on Centre Mobile. I will go to my to my to my app, yes, or I will go to uh, dial star two one one hash, and be able to pick the funds transfer and be able to transfer to buy Michael money in another bank within minutes. 
without Absolutely. me leaving the comfort of my home or the comfort of my office or my, the comfort of wherever it is. I could even be in a bar, Michael, and I could mm. still do these transactions. You could yes. be in, in America today. You could be in the UK. You could be working in the UAE and you want to send Michael in Uganda money and you have an account. Firstly, account in Centenary Bank. Secondly, registered on Centre Mobile. Initiate an EFT, put in the amount, confirm your PIN, send mm. the money. It will be into Michael's account within minutes. Uh, so, let's utilize all those new innovations that the bank has come up for you, our customers. Thank you. Absolutely. And by being able to utilize the EFT feature on Center Mobile, you will automatically enter the drop enter the for drop. as long as you you know you you use it at least three times in a week. Because I mean, this is a a convenient feature for people who are you know doing business paying people across across the the you know the other banks so once you do that you'll be able to stand a chance to enter the draw where you'll win a hundred thousand shillings on a weekly someone was asking you much later um, because they are in kalamoja so they want to know uh, i'm in kalamoja but you know i'm transacting do i also qualify to you know to stand a chance of winning a hundred thousand shillings, maybe just to clarify on that, Karamoja is part of Uganda certainly, but <laughs> actually just to, to you know, to shed some light on that one. Michael, absolutely, absolutely, you could be in Antarctica, you could be in Alaska, you could be. I mean, I'm I'm now stretching it. Karamoja is very close, Michael. It is in Uganda. If in you are in Uganda, because if you are in a, if you are in Alaska, it doesn't take away the fact that you have to pay your car for your parent. If you are the yes. one who pays it, it doesn't take away the fact that you have to pay school fees. You know, if you have children or dependents in Uganda, it doesn't take away the fact that you may need to transfer funds from mm. your account to Michael's account or send an EFT to whoever. So yes. it doesn't matter whether you're in Karamoja. Or in Alaska, like I said, you could be in Boston in the States, you could be in Coventry, Manchester, Croydon, yes. UAE, you could be in Dubai, you could be wherever, Abu Dhabi. Yes. Our customers and listeners, you are all eligible and you will get this money if you win. And you first, firstly, you will get a message yes. on your phone. About an hour before the money is credited onto your account, you get a message from us congratulating you and telling you. And the message comes from a, 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 an SMS message will come first code named Centenary Bank. So then you know that you're dealing with a legit, the legit Centenary Bank. It's legit. That's important. Mm. So you get it about an hour before. Then after an hour, you will get a, the transaction alert giving you the amount and i'm very sure we are all wise about our money in wise i mean we always know how much we have so if you knew your balance you will get a message an alert telling you yeah received a hundred thousand and it will give you then your new balance if you're still doubting you can then dial star to one one hash Go to balance inquiry and inquire what your new balance is. You can even go a step further and pick your mini statement and be able to identify the last transaction as the money that you have won. And uh, uh, fellow lis uh, listeners and viewers this morning, Centenary Bank will not call you to ask you for your PIN, to ask you to share details of your, of, of your visa card, to yes. take pictures of it. We will never do that. We are your bankers. We have this information and we have better ways of requesting. We will not go on social media to request you. You'll only yeah. receive mess informational messages from us. Not again asking you for details. Let's be yes. wise with our money. I thank you, Michael. Absolutely. Spot on much late there. Of course, we'll also be touching on the issue of, uh, of you know, these fraudsters that tend to want to confuse our customers and you that conversation has really laid the ground for us to to kick off that topic but right now as uh, i give you a breather <laughs> and i think it's only fair let me pick let me just read out a few comments from uh, the chat that are coming through from uh, our viewers countrywide and uh, outside the country there's uh scovia 
Charisima, she says, I love Centenary Bank. Thank you so much for the love. We love you too, certainly. Uh, Rugaram, uh, that's Edson Rugaram, Rugarabamu. Hello, hello, Edson, from wherever you're tuned in. Thank you so much for being a part of this live stream. There's Maurice, amazing. Thank you so much. Good morning from St. Pija. Uh, colleagues who are commenting, our viewers, you can also leave us a comment on where you're tuned in from, such that we can be able to send you some uh, some shout outs there. Um, there's uh, Samuel Okia who is talking about the fact that if he wants to withdraw three times, but uh, I withdrew money three times, but I had, no, uh, you know, I think he had no idea about the promotion. Now, the withdrawing we're talking about. Uh, Okia is not on over the ATM, you know, via the ATM rather. You have to do that at an agent to be sure that um, uh, you stand a chance to enter the campaign. So you can actually use your card because that uh, future is, is configured at the center agent point for you to be able to withdraw. I hope you did that. But also, like I said earlier, it's quite competitive. There's a lot of numbers coming in. People are transacting. The fact that we lowered the number of times people are supposed to be able to transact. And so it's really, really competitive. So for you to stand a chance, you have to make sure that you transact um, a little more. The other thing you can use with your card, uh, as opposed to withdrawing money from the ATM, just use it to pay that, you know, whatever you want to pay. If, you know, you're getting money to go and lunch with your family over the weekend, you don't need to do that. You can use the same card to pay at uh, a variety of restaurants here in Kampala, but also uh, across the, the across the world, as long as they accept visa. If you're going to have a drink, you know, with friends at the bar, you can still use your card. You don't need to withdraw that money from the ATM. First and foremost, it's bulky. Secondly, it's time wasting for you to come to the ATM to withdraw, and yet you have a card. So please be sure to enjoy that service. There's uh, another comment from... My name's like Michael Imalingat. You're saying thank you so much. Our marketing strategist is our bank. Thank you for the love. Then uh, Joshua Omwene Mafundo. And this is a question to our one and only Nancy. He says, I want to open an account, but uh, I am not in Uganda. Is it possible? I think Nancy, as we give you much later, brother, I, I want you to come in briefly and, and talk about, uh, you know, talk to Joshua, and then we can pick it up from there. Nancy? Uh, thank you, Michael. Uh, hello, Joshua. Thank you for tuning in. Um, uh, first of all, yes, you can open an account when you're not in Uganda. It's possible for you. Uh, the question is, is where are you? <laughs> so that we can customize it for you even better. Thank you very much. Uh, what you need is a Ugandan national ID. Uh, we have come up with an online account opening uh, platform, which will enable you open an account from wherever you are, regardless Absolutely. of where you are. In outside of Uganda, you can always open an account with Centenary Bank. Thank you yeah. very much. There you go. There you had it, uh, Joshua. I, before the, the stream ends, we'll uh, obviously share some contact information for Nancy here, her email and uh, the number you can use to WhatsApp her if you want to carry on that conversation offline such that uh, she can even guide you better. Now, um, back to the Satu Kusatu campaign, uh, our dear viewers. There's a, a question, you know, we've got a number of questions that came in earlier and uh, we'll, we'll try to address those as we are also looking at the ones that are coming in now through the chat. There was uh, a someone called Timothy who wanted to know how many winners have been rewarded so far. Now we've rewarded about 168 winners since we started out. I think it's coming to about a month. That's an average of about 56 you know, winners per, per week. Uh, like I said, it's, it's really competitive. Just check out our social media pages. We always upload these lists, these lists there the moment uh, the, the sorting is done and we have uh, the final list of winners you'll be able to see it there then uh, the other came in uh, around uh, when when you are selected to be a winner how are you contacted i think imachlet uh, did share some information on this and she was talk she was you know talking to us about the fact that you'll get an sms first and foremost to notify you that you've won but also you should be able to get an alert because the money is uh, are sent to 
to, to your account. So we're not going to call you uh, because there's quite a number of people that are winning for that matter. So just look out for those. In case you don't get the you know SMS alert, you will still uh, be able to get the alert to notify you that the money is on your account. Now, imagine uh, there's a, a card, you know, uh, a Visa card that uh, has been around for about two or so years that our people who don't exactly have account a relationship with Centenary Bank can take advantage of to be able to, you know, to participate in the campaign. I just wanted you to sp uh, please share a little more about that card. But also I know that uh, I think about a week or two ago, we were actually able to enhance our platforms by adding a feature that enables uh, people that people who are holding that particular card to be able to reload the monies without necessarily having to visit the branch. Imagine, please come in and let's somewhat talk about that card and then we shall continue with our conversation. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Michael. Uh, our viewers, listeners, uh, we have two card schemes with a visa. We have the ordinary debit card, which uh, we get when we open our account and request for a card. And then we have the prepaid visa card. Now, the prepaid visa card, you don't necessarily have to hold an account with Centenary Bank. You are a Centenary Bank customer. And Mike, Michael, I want to, to allay everybody's fears that everybody here is either an actual or a potential customer of Centenary Bank. So you're all our customers and yes. you're welcome. That aside, you can be a cent Centenary Bank said, okay, they are customers because we serve various needs different needs and we are cognizant of the fact that customers have different needs a customer will say ah, i have no need for an account but certainly i have a need for the center prepaid visa card yes. so you will come into the branch you will fill half a page of a form with about five questions your name your phone number your name the national identification number and you will request for this center visa prepaid card you will get the card and you will load money onto mm. the card. The value that you load is the the value that the card will hold. Yes. You ca it will work uh, when when it comes to using it to pay you for your services, for your goods, for petrol station, for for fuel at petrol stations, in supermarkets, online. If you're a student and you're undertaking courses like uh, ACCA, SIM. ICSA, there are so many uh, international programs. You're in university abroad or locally, and you're requested to pay using card, a mm -hmm. debit card. This card will suffice. The beauty okay. with this center visa prepaid card, and I want to emphasize the word visa, because for a card, uh, most of the vendors will ask you, is it visa, is it MasterCard, is it China Union Pay? So for the mm -hmm. center prepaid visa card, you do not necessarily have to hold an account in Centenary. You could actually hold an account in Centenary Bank and you say, mm -mm, I am going to separate my expenses for yes. all the money that I am going to spend outside, within, maybe within my, my, my monthly expenses, I am going to load on my prepaid card because then I can control my expenses. So the card yes. will only yeah. hold the value, the kind of, the kind of money that you have budgeted that you're going to spend. So it's also a budgeting tool. It will help you. So you load the value of this money. Where can you go a step further and say, Immaculate, your branches are sometimes busy. Where can I load this card? You can go to a center agent and actually load this card. You load the value. You want to spend 200000 this week? You tell the you give the agent your card. They load the value of two hundred thousand uh, on your on on your card, and you go and spend. You yes, can spend yes. on the very same things you used to spend on the uh, debit card. You can pay fuel, supermarket shopping. You can pay for goods online. All these or Amazon, eBay, uh, 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 Alibaba, all those uh, ha vendor houses that where you sometimes have to go as digital uh, people, people who are on the move, who are busy, who want... To... The world became a global village, so you shop anything you buy from China in the comfort of your room. So this card will help you. 
And if you're a Centenary Bank customer, and this I emphasize, Centenary Bank customer, because only when you're a Centenary Bank customer can you then uh, be registered on Centre Mobile. You can also have uh, the option of loading your, your, your Centre Visa prepaid card using your Centre Mobile. You go to the Centre Mobile. Uh, if you have an app, you go to your, you open up your app. Go to loading options for prepaid for prepaid card. Load your the value that you want off your account straight into your card and start spending. So all these options options are are, are, are free for you to use. They are not free. There is a small uh, charge that yes, we, yes. you will pay to use them. And then also you can go to the branch. If the two fail agent, which is very convenient, I talked about five thousand four hundred agents. And if you have you 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 don't you're not you you don't have Centre Mobile, you're not a Centenary Bank customer, then oh. you can walk into a branch. This service is there and it's quick. So we have three loading options: branch, Centre Agent, Centre Mobile. Please use them for the convenience. Use your prepaid card. If you do not have a prepaid card, you can walk into any branch and request for. I said you have small uh, one page. It's actually half a page of, of yeah. form that you need to fill out. Request for this card. Within the space of about 10 to 20 minutes, you'll be out of the branch with your card and you will transact instantly. The moment you step out. Even if you went to a, an ATM uh, machine, when you have stepped out of the banking hall or in the banking hall, the moment that the value is loaded on your phone, you can withdraw part of the money. Because I remember that I, I explained that the very same things that the Sente Visa card does, debit card does for you, are the same things that the prepaid will do for you. Michael, I hope I have been clear on the prepaid I Visa absolutely card. absolutely and uh, the beauty is that uh, whoever is tuned in you can actually replay this uh, video because it will be recorded and uh, it will stay on our pages so you can uh, replay it and get some of these tips that he much later was sharing and the information we've just made it absolutely convenient for you to reload your card so so that you can continue using it you you don't need to branch off at uh, a centenary bank uh, uh branch if you if you can't do that you can you know find the nearest agent and you'll be able to to do that that if you don't have an account with us but for those who have accounts send a mobile there's an option for reloading your card right from your account and you'll be able to pull that money to your card such that you transact as we move on i also just wanted us imagine now to touch on the issue of uh of how to transact securely or safely using this card but before that, I want to pick one or two comments from the comment section because it's buzzing with uh, some feedback from, from customers all over and uh, users who are tuned in such that we, we then get back to the conversation of how to transact safely and securely, which will also lead us now into how to avoid falling a victim of the fraudsters that are out there waiting to take advantage of you know us and our customers. We A comment came in from... Um, from Africa, Zuri, you're asking why do you charge transfer fees when we are in the same bank? Well, uh, initially we did mention Africa that we are doing a comprehensive review of our pricing. So we shall be able to come back to you, to you, our customers, uh, once that process is done on, uh, you know, the, the new pricing, pricing guide. It's a process we are going through. We got feedback from here on social media, but also customers who come to us in the branches and that's a process that is ongoing. We shall be able to get back to you once it's done. There's a Emmanuel who is saying speak Swahili, tutaongea Swahili sana, but for today, we're going to keep it English. We'll be sure to probably <laughs> outsource uh, a host, a co-host who can uh, confidently speak Swahili such that we, you know, we don't embarrass that that uh, language that is being put forward to become the national language for the, the East African community. Otherwise, uh, I assume probably you are in Kenya or Tanzania. Well, why I think last week 
were there last week attending the Rotary District Conference and you know the people of Arusha really gave us so much love. We are looking into the possibility of establishing some uh, outlets there in the near future such, to, such that we're able to bank you know them to bank to, to, to give them services. There is a uh, Chibuka Dan. You're saying we need to check out our Boyogere branch. What's wrong with a TV calling tokens that has been picked up? And by the way, we have colleagues that are you know behind the scenes, our customer service experience, our customer experience colleagues that are going to be responding to you. But also some of these comments are being picked up and relayed live to our various branches and stakeholders for. Uh, resolution. Thank you so much for that. Then Diana, Diana Mary, you're saying you can't open your app be, uh, because you did reset your, uh, you did reset, you set my phone. I think th there's an error that customers get once you change the handset. So say if your phone was stolen, unfortunately, and then you purchase another one, you need to get to us such that we can help you disable that is a security feature that uh, we configured with our IT team basically to ensure that it's a rightful person you know it's, it's a right person accessing the account so we can't know unless you 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 know you get to us and we're able to help you however in future we're also working on an option where you can be able to clear the error such that you can access your center mobile banking platform after changing changing handsets for now that's what it is because we want to keep your money safe we don't want to risk uh your phone being stolen and then people are able to access your account so that is why it is like that in the time being walusimbi uh just a second let me go back a bit walusimbi you're saying hello yes hello how are you godfrey sekaja uh yeah regards to you thank you so much then uh, there is david fisher how much could be the charges to transfer money from Qatar to Centenary Bank. This one, I'll, uh, Nancy, please take note of this. You will support me to answer this one because this is our diaspora customer. And then lastly, I'm going to end with Oslen Trisha. You're saying I can't check my account balance using Center Mobile yet. I received a new PIN from the bank and activated my Center Mobile Banking app. Well, um, Oslin, please DM us, and I, I say this with uh, some degree of certainty. Do, make sure you're sending your details. Either you send us details on uh, info, just give us details, your account name and you know the number that you're using. You either share them on info, uh, the info email info at centenarybank.co.ug, or you DM us on Facebook. Make sure the page you're interacting with is verified. It normally has a uh, it normally has a, a tick. The Facebook verified page for Centenary Bank has a tick on it, such that before you share those details with us to avoid your details being accessed by the fraudsters. So Nancy, the question was, how can the, the transfer of money from Qatar to Uganda? I think they wanted an indication on, on the charges, but before we even talk about the charges, there are some options I know that uh, our customers in the diaspora can use to transfer money, to send money to either their accounts here, you know, or other people's accounts in, in, in Uganda. Maybe speak into that briefly before then we get back to the main conversation. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Michael. Um, from Qatar to Uganda, I cannot give an indicative figure, but it is a TT charge, uh, mostly dependent on their bank, how they're sending. It's the other bank that charges. Okay. But yeah. when it comes in here, uh, the options here is it's maybe Western Union. Western Union now can do bank to bank. Okay. He can send, he can get a, a Western Union agent the other side and then deposit money directly to his bank account. Yeah. Okay. There are tiers depending on how much they're sending. And the agent at that end will advise. And when it right. comes to TT, still the bank will advise because when it comes to Qatar, uh, I mean their currency, then it has to be changed into forex, the USD, which is our main uh, foreign exchange uh, currency, and then into their UGX account. So it's all yeah. dependent on the 
uh, remittance company, the other side, or the bank, I should yeah. say. But the option he has, uh, there are more remittance agents uh, for which they know, the people there know, and then uh, Western Union, then also the correspondent bank, which is uh, ours is Citibank, yeah. that side. Yes, thank you very much. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Nancy. Now, um, Imachulet and, and Nancy, the conversation that we, I want us to tackle in the next, uh, I think, seven or so minutes is really about how customers can be able to securely transact on, on these channels that, that we've mentioned. Center Mobile, we've mentioned the cards, that's a debit card and, uh, and the prepaid card visa, and then we've mentioned the agents. We'll start with uh, the card because it's... Uh, it, it's it's somewhat special because uh you know the information is just on the card so people need to somewhat manage it well and and maybe imagine just a few tips on how customers can safely transact using the center visa prepaid and debit cards uh, which i'll also supplement too because i do have a few tips and then we'll move into center mobile before we close with the agent banking platform imagine Okay, so thank you very much, Michael. Uh, our viewers, listeners, uh, maybe for start uh, to start up on this, money is very difficult to come by. Our responsibility as as customers is firstly to keep our money. It is our cardinal duty to ensure that our money is safe. I will start with the things that Centenary Bank will not ask you to do. Under no circumstance will Centenary Bank ask you to take pictures of your visa card or read the numbers that are inscribed on, Centen on, your, on your card and then to ask you to turn the back. There is a number that is written on the, and say, saying CVV. It's normally a three-letter number. That, because a fraudster will tell you, read the number or take a picture of your card both sides and the moment you do that you are gone centenary bank we are your bankers we know your details and we have four more ways within which to reach you in the event that we need to consult you regarding your card we will never go on social media and request you to give us details of your card we will never go send you a message asking you to share details of your card yes Better still, we'll never ask you to take pictures of your card to share with us. If you realize that somebody is taking you down that road, please do not accompany them. Do not share your detail. The card or even if on Center Mobile, ask, somebody asks you for your PIN, don't share your PIN. Your PIN is the key to your money. Yes. And it is your responsibility, firstly, we share the responsibility, but you as the customer, it is your responsibility firstly to ensure that the money you work hard for is kept securely and safely. Absolutely. Be wise with your money. Do not share those details. And I will repeat, Centenary Bank will never ask you to share your pin. Not on, not on Twitter, not on, on Facebook, not on Instagram, not on any of our social forums will never send you a message asking you to share details of your card the numbers inscribed on your card they are private those are the keys that unlock the value on your card in your account and i repeat the numbers on your card are the keys that unlock the value on your card in your bank account mm -hmm. kindly do not share for the prepaid card for those of you with the mastercard uh, I'm sure our listeners, viewers are aware Centenary has, Bank has a Platinum MasterCard. Please yes. do not share the detail of your card with anybody. And then there's also this issue of over-trusting and then you send children. These days, children are more even tech-savvy. Our children are more, even more tech-savvy than we are. And sometimes they get misled. And then they want to buy things on the platforms where they interact. And they will get mommy's card, either innocently or otherwise, or daddy's card. And key in the numbers, you probably will realize that money is leaving your account. And you're not sure you'll say no. Until we go down and dig deep and we look at the transactions and realize yes. that either your child bought a game 
on 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 the platforms or your child bought a gadget oh th there are so many programs that children can buy exactly. and this is yes yeah, so let us be wise with our money your pin number for center mobile is the key that unlocks the value in your account in your on on your phone the number inscribed on both sides of your card uh. is the is the is the number that unlocks the value kindly do not and i repeat do not and should you their controls should you change a handset many times uh, nancy always gets this oh i changed a handset and now i am locked out we uh. have an email where we reach our diaspora clients our clients who can't come in mostly our diaspora clients diaspora banking at centenarybank.co.ug i will repeat diaspora banking at centenarybank.co.ug reach out uh you will be asked some questions that confirm that we are speaking to the customer yes. themselves and then we will allow you to then reset your pin the bank will not reset the pin for you you will reset the pin for yourself so then you have a fresh pin and you're able to transact in the event that you have changed a handset and you have been using the app the center mobile app you might be asked to do that yes so please uh, reach out, uh, diaspora banking, at diaspora banking at centenarybank.co.ug. Uh, reach out. Uh, we have very many people on that platform. There will always be somebody to support you. So kindly, you. kindly, kindly, let's be wise about our money. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Imachulet. You've touched on, uh, I think, one, one. there's a point I need to emphasize on among the ones that you've discussed, and it's the point of, of, of you know, parents, you know, fathers or partners giving their cards to other people, you know. Um, that that's, has seemed to be a challenge of sorts. So, because like Imachulet mentioned, the only thing that someone needs is the number at the front of your card and the three digits at the back of your card to be able to uh, you know access your account so be very very careful but also when you're buying things online you're doing e-commerce there are some sites where you have to uncheck or untick the option of recurrent uh, uh, deductions so i think those of you who have done maybe registration for subscription for, for the Zoom account or any of those accounts, you find that if you do not uh, remove your card details after subscribing, those deductions will continue being made. So after a, a long while, probably you're thinking someone is taking money off your bank, but it's because you, you forgot to uncheck the box that says, please don't, don't do recurrent deductions on my account for you, you know, to be able to avoid those recurrent uh, subscriptions then uh, the other thing also is is the card swapping and that normally happens at uh, at the atms so if if you really need to ask for help you know from anyone please ensure that one you're interacting with the centenary bank staff uh, you know don't get random strangers at the atm to be able to help you because our colleagues at the branches are there and very willing to help you it will take you about one two minutes to walk into the branch and request for support you know for for someone to support you otherwise with some most times people come and uh, we notice that their cards were swapped because they try to get support from strangers in the atm and unfortunately they end up losing their money um there's an option on um center mobile banking platform should you suspect that uh you know your card has been compromised or maybe someone has uh probably you're seeing transactions that you don't understand you can actually or should you lose it in the event that you lose a wallet or you're not able to trace it for any reason you can actually block your card on center mobile momentarily you know you block it until you're able to find it if you're not able to find it you you know you'll have to just walk into the branch and then uh, the team is able to cancel that particular card number and issue with a new card such that you do not run the risk of your card being out there in uh, you know with an, an unauthorized person 
will be able to access your your account then um definitely michael yes much later. i wanted to emphasize something on the center agent as well and i think it's important because uh we have a lot of our customers who have now since migrated and uh with the satukusa too and so many other campaigns that we've done before this have now totally moved to agent when you go to interact with the agent whether you're going to withdraw money at the agent point please protect your pin even if you're going to withdraw not using your card but simply withdraw money at an agent point you will yes. initiate the transaction on your phone and the, the 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 agent will get the message electronically and they will ask you to enter your pin you will only enter the pin on your phone and when you're entering this pin please ensure that you are the only person who is seeing the pin and then Absolutely. it will say okay and then you will the agent will hand over the value the amount of money that you're looking to get not at any one time when you've gone to do all these transactions should you share your pin even at agent location like i said your pin is the key that unlocks the value at agent point at center mobile and the numbers on your card are the keys that unlock the value on your phone on your account when you're using the card please guard this jealously absolutely i mean you you could not have overemphasized that because of the importance you know that comes with it and just also to supplement on immaculates please ensure that you always uh live with a receipt the moment you're transacting at any agent location um because they do have you know small printers receipts that can be generated and that's the only evidence that you can show that you actually deposited money or you you transacted avoid transacting when the system is off the moment an agent tells you uh the system is off but you can you know maybe leave the money i'll deposit for you and you will receive the message you know we, we do not we discourage that ensure that at all times you're transacting the system is actually up such that you're able to get a receipt for you to show as evidence of the transaction before i go into the comments uh, as we close i just wanted to mention there's a you know a question that came in from brian who is saying is the is the Satu Kusatu campaign part of the 40th anniversary we've been seeing on WhatsApp? Thank you so much. This is a good question, but unfortunately, I hate to disappoint you by saying that no, it's not part of it. The 40th anniversary fake link was uh, is being moved around by fraudsters. We are not celebrating any 40 years of an you know our anniversary. We and normally when we have any kind of promotions that are ongoing, we actually broadcast them on our social media camp, uh, social media pages. Uh, for some customers, those whose emails we have, we actually send out emails to share information about the various campaigns that we have, just like we are doing for the Satu Kusatu campaign. So please ignore uh, any links, any WhatsApps that you get that are talking about the 40th anniversary because they are not from us. Uh, kindly kindly do not even click the links they are in because once you do that you will then expose your uh, computer your phone to a vulnerability of you know a, a fraudster being able to access your information and then lastly lastly i would like to of course notify you that we now have an agent banking locator on our website i think you've been seeing some posts on social media you should be able to locate an agent depending on the location you're in the nearest agent to you using that locator such that it saves you a bit of time but also to quickly identify where you can you can bank from and this is across across the country so thank you so much now as we close i want to pick about two comments and then i'll let him actually let do some parting shots as well as nancy then we you know call it a session for today Oslon, you're saying, please, because I do not want to go to the bank since there is too much lining, I do not have an ATM yet, but access my money from wherever I am. Oslon, like I mentioned earlier, please uh, share your DMS with some details and our, my colleagues will be able to support you 
to ensure that you can reconnect on your Centre Mobile Banking platform. Then uh, Alex Junior, you're saying Centenary Bank, the only trustworthy bank in the world. Uh, thanks for the customer service to us and salary to heads, manager, office, business development, marketing, and branding. I thank you. Thank you for appreciating, uh, uh, Alex. We really appreciate your feedback. Then James, uh, Jimmy, rather, William, you're saying I'm James. Okay, I'm James Oceano in Qatar. We need to save money with you people, but sometimes you find that the money on the accounts is being taken now we of course we handle customers accounts with the utmost integrity and honesty because we we sign up to that this relationship that we have with you is based on trust so if at any one point you notice uh, funds are leaving your account without your knowledge it's not a transaction that you've initiated please reach out immediately you know you can reach us on social media or email us uh, via info at centenarybank.co.ug or call if you can call their numbers actually you can call if, even if you are outside of the country for us to be able to attend to you as quickly as possible to block your account and do some investigations find out where the deductions are coming from otherwise it's not uh, uh, an intention so we need to work together to ensure that uh, we're able to cap this, but also set some alerts to make sure that you monitor your transactions on the account. Then the last two, one coming in from Moanika Julius, you're saying, why is it that uh, why is it that that banking when you're using Center Mobile most of the time doesn't reach the account? Would like to seek some clarification here. Yeah, I think you're uh, pushing money to your account. Uh, money should be able to hit your account. I mean, I've done it colleagues have done it here kindly share your details and probably some transaction details and we'll be able to review then uh, revert back to you then lastly we have ibra thanks for the broadcast and this is uh you're saying and this is really good information to share with us clans thank you so much uh, our viewers that's all the time we had today for those comments that we haven't been able to touch i guarantee you that that we're going to be able to answer them because their colleagues are already doing that in the background. So please don't worry. We apologize because of time we have to end here. But before we do that, I'd like to give you much let about a minute to be able to speak to us some parting shots about the Satu Kusatu campaign and generally uh, then uh, Nancy as well and we'll close it off. Much let. Uh, thank you very much, Michael, uh, for leading us on this one. Uh, our valued customers, I'd like to thank you very much. Uh, we are humbled by your custom. Uh, thank you for keeping on trusting us, trusting us with your custom, trusting us with your, 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 your feedback. We thrive on the feedback. Keep the feedback coming. And all of you, please get involved in the Satu Kusatu. There is money to be won. We are still rewarding the whole of May into June into july let's transact and win and also create some kind of behavior that will help us propel ourselves forward gone are the days when we had a lot of time on our hands to be everywhere now we have limited time and millions of things to do so this kind of because you'll ask why satu kusat we are trying to inculcate a behavior that is going to save you time save you money save you basically save 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 you with on costs but Absolutely. make your life a lot easier so that is the kind of behavior that we are inculcating while rewarding you so be part of the journey be part of this program satuku satu is out for you still out for you we will be rewarding next weeks in may june july be part of it you, and don't worry you can win as many times as you can this is a bonanza for you our customers so i'd like to thank you again and good afternoon absolutely thank you much late thank you for those parting shots um nancy you had one or two liners for your diaspora customers but you also wanted to yeah. say something on the card yes, yes. Mm. Uh, thank you michael i'll start with the card um uh, First and foremost, uh, this really goes to my diaspora customers. Uh, many times they do want to share their ATMs because they are leaving and they want to leave some money for the family to keep coming in. So they opt to leave their ATM cards. Uh, I want to 
tell them that as a bank we discourage that and uh, we came up with this diaspora account to sort that kind of uh, challenge for them you don't have to leave your card behind uh, yeah. what you should do is open your account then have sent a mobile we have alternative channels that can enable you to transfer monies to wherever you want okay and yeah. run your errands risks wherever you are so you don't have to share your atm card as alia mentioned michael and um my colleague uh, Immaculate, as they emphasized, please don't share your cards, whether with your children or your parents, because we have enabled you to have an account that can enable you to do transactions everywhere. Yeah. So kindly Absolutely. don't share. Uh, then the other thing is that many will ask, do we also qualify for Kusatu Kusatu? Yes, other <laughs> poor customers do qualify. You're going to ask yourselves, will I be able to transact with the agent while I'm in UK, US or UAE? Yes, you can. Many of you have uh, income generating projects down here in Uganda. You can ask those people to deposit at the agent's point. Then use your center visa card wherever you are. Many times you use it for POS, uh, even to withdraw cash off the, those ATMs in your respective countries, then also yeah. send a mobile. Then that qualifies you to enter the what? <laughs> the draw. So you can also win. Thank you so very much. Thank you for the support and thank you for banking with us. Uh, for account opening, you can open an account wherever you are uh, because we now have an, uh, 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 an online account opening platform that can yeah. enable you to open an account. All you need is your Ugandan national ID and then we can share the details. Uh, Michael, kindly re-echo the email address that these customers can reach us and then we shall share also my contact for those of you who want to ask those other questions that maybe we have not addressed. Thank you so very much. Good oh, afternoon fantastic. and good morning to my diaspora customer. <laughs> yes, indeed. So just to re-echo the email address that uh, Nancy is talking about, that is diaspora banking at centenarybank.co.ug. It's scrolling down on your screen. You can be able to pick it from there. Diaspora banking at centenarybank.co.ug. So our, view, our dear viewers, unfortunately, that's all the time we had. But I uh, will again look forward to engaging you. We'll, we'll find another excuse to come here and engage you. I think we'll, we'll have a session on just fraud awareness, just to, you know, to discuss and talk to you about how you can securely transact on these uh, digital channels to avoid being a victim of, you know, fraud, which we've, uh, in, in the recent past, we've had a number of, uh, you know, cases coming up. But uh, one of the things is uh, s s some of the customers who come up, you find that it's it's an issue of, of not being very much aware of how to you know to protect yourself and transact safely so we'll probably have a session on that to give you a couple of tips on how to do that such that your money is safe and that you enjoy banking with us as you take part in the satu kusatu campaign remember it's just three transactions per week from any of the channels including center mobile center visa or the center agents for us who are here. Then also look out for our market activations. We've been doing a couple of them in the in the central region here. We started with the eastern region, and this week, and I think the following week, we're in the western region uh, of, of the country, trying to engage with you, trying to you know show you how to do certain transactions using those channels as we you know boost your chances of winning in the Satu Kusatu campaign. So thank you so much for you know watching and listening for those of you who are unable to watch the video. We'll uh, engage the next time. Watch out. Till next time, take care. Bye bye. Satu 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 Kusatu Satu Satu Kusente Agenti Satu Kusente Mobile Satu Kusente Visa Satu 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 Kusatu Satu Do the Satu Kusatu and smile Do the Satu Kusatu and smile Do the Satu Kusatu and win Win crazy money in Satu Kusatu Transact three or more times using Center Mobile Center Agent or Center Visa And win 100k weekly Directly on two your account the more you transact the more you win terms and conditions apply centenary bank our bank centenary bank is regulated by the bank of uganda customer deposits are protected by the deposit protection fund